Michael and Donna Kramer have owned Ancient Stone Inspiration shops for seven years, but it wasn't until recent that they added a new product to their store. We started the brew line about a month ago, Max Home Brew. Uh, it's lots of fun. We have all the equipment to make beer, wine, all the ingredients, um, special yeast, and uh, we can help you with any trouble spots you might have too. They definitely can help because the Kramers know all about home brewing. We've enjoyed making our own uh, beer and wine for quite some time, and we didn't have anywhere to buy our own in ingredients and things, so well, we'll just offer that for everybody that comes in. Don't be intimidated by all these parts. Making your own wine and beer is simple. For wine, all you need is any kind of fruit, store-bought or homegrown, and this. Our vino vessel, and then that's our primary fermenter. It's where you put all your fruit in a bag with water, sugar. Then you, after a few days, you move that into the secondary vessel. Then you let it sit for a few months, move it to another vessel one more time to help it clear, and then bottle and cork. But brewing beer is a little bit different. The beer you're actually doing a little cooking. You got a little cooking involved. You're going to spend about an hour at the stove. But don't worry, just follow the kit directions. You cook your wort and you still go into a pro similar process, going into a primary. But based, most of the time you'll just go straight from your primary to like a bottling bucket and you'll just go right to the bottle from there. Then sit back and sip. You just won't really want to go back to drinking the regular off-the-shelf beer. But don't take the Kramer's word for it. Try it out and see if homemade brew is right for you. Kristen Aguirre, KHQA News, Quincy.